So, it's me, Phil Oldershaw here, again. Uh, I wasn't going to do a live, I just came straight back from being on air from Solihull Radio, where I've been in the studio, and then I've come back to cook. I've just thrown a couple of salmon fillets in there, almost cut, look, still nice and pink on the inside. I've taken them down and off the heat, just to let them naturally finish cooking through. The tail broke off that one. Uh, I've got some plates in the microwave, just getting some heat going through them like so. Uh, and I'm just going to present. So basically, I'm just going to show you what I've done. I've already done it all. I'm not really going to go through anything else with you. So I've just cooked up this beautiful bit of cabbage, which I've cooked in with some red wine, a little bit of white wine vinegar and some turmeric in there, just to give it a really nice tang. In this bowl, I've just poppy pinged in the microwave some Mons 2, some red pepper, some tomatoes, uh, and some French green beans. Well, they didn't actually speak, so I don't know if they're French or not. But anyway, you know the sort of beans I mean. Um, and then I've also just knocked up this sauce here, which I've used a couple of spoonfuls of the uh, turmeric sauce um, juice that I've cooked this in with the red wine. Uh, then I've also put in some pineapple and some creme fraiche in there, uh, some lime, some lemon, some honey, uh, and a little splash of vinegar as well. It tastes bellissimo, a nice balance between sweet, sour, creamy, uh, with that pineapple freshness coming through. So literally, I'm just gonna serve it up, which will be something like this. So what we'll do, let's just transfer back, that back to there for a moment. I'm just going to drain off the waters so that we've got rid of most of the water there. Just going to put that back in. Just while we go back to doing that again, because we want to serve the cabbage up. Woo! Almost put that in that thing. Uh, hi to you, sorry that it seems quick, but this is how quick you can do it. Oh, I need to prep some things. Quick, get home. I had two salmon fillets in the fridge. Had some cabbage up on the shelf there that I just sliced up into strips to be able to make the bed here. Uh, it's not often that I make the bed, so to speak. Uh, so there we are. We're just going to put that on the bottom like that. And I'm just going to layer this up, which will be the nice thing about it. Also, I'm just going to have a little taste of this cabbage. So I cooked this in red wine and white wine vinegar with some turmeric. Mm. It's really fresh cabbage, gives it a really different edge. Still got a bit of bite to it as well, which is, oh wow, that's just incredible. So we're going to do the same here with the peppers and the beans. So we're just going to serve that, put the beans over the top like so. Just do the same with this side of the plate as well. Really simple to do. Um, this is going to be packed with goodness as well. Because uh, obviously the beans, the mons too, they've all got lots of vitamins. Almost like you've just picked them out of the garden. And that's the great thing about it. As well, we're just going to spoon out some of these peppers and tomatoes there as well. Gives it that nice bit of colour as well. But also there's uh, some different elements to the dish that will give a nice bit of flavour. There we are, that's done as well. See what we did there. And I'm just going to serve up the salmon. So there's one here that I'm just going to serve over the top. The great thing about this as well is the lack of carbs. We've got some beautiful fresh salmon that's going to be still nice and pink and soft in the middle. I've crisped up the skin, so you always put the skin first down with this. I've crisped up the skin to get the best from it. And then I'm just going to finish with this lovely dressing that I've made. Uh, so I did microwave it just to soften the pineapple a little bit um, with the vinegar, with some of the turmeric and red wine, white wine vinegar sauce. Uh, and then I put the sour cream in afterwards to give it a good stir. And now literally I'm just going to spoon this over the salmon here. This will make a real tart but flavoursome sauce. And this is all we're going to need to go with this salmon because it's going to be bursting with flavour. The pineapple's punchy, we've got the honey in there. 
As you can see, it's wet, so we got the sauce mix in there as well, which is going to be enough to go through those vegetables, which are already al dente anyway, so they're going to be bursting with flavour as well. And that's it. I've literally called this. We'll, we'll show you. We'll show you this one. Uh, this is salmon uh, a la pineapple creme. <laughs> Where do I get the names from? I have no idea at all. Flavoursome, light, no carbs, not too heavy this time of night. Protein, vitamins, all your omega 3s. Um, and it's just going to be a really tasty dish. That's it in a nutshell. Uh, so, finding Phil's flavours, here they are on a plate. Now we're going to eat it.